Hey guys and welcome back to another trade up video. Today I'm using a different mic so if I sound different then that's why. But anyways today I'm going to show you 6 trade ups in 3 different price ranges, 2 in the 1 to 5 euro price range, 2 in the 5 to 10 euro price range, and 2 in the 10 euro plus price range. But before we do that I just wanted to mention a few things. First is that we are very close to the 1000 subscriber mark so if you could help me out hitting that before the month of April, that would be really appreciated. And also I use TradeUp Spy to calculate everything about these trade-ups. So if you're interested, then I'll, I left my affiliate link down in the description. If you use that to buy premium, it helps out the channel and I would really appreciate that as well. And also I have a Discord server, so if you'd like to join, then I left the link down in the description. Go check it out. So the first two trade-ups are gonna be in the one to five euro range. This is what the first trade-up looks like. It costs one euros and 22 cents and it has a profitability of 25.34%, making you 31 cents every time you complete this trade-up. For the inputs, you're going to need 7 minimal wear industrial grade dust 2 skins. With buy orders, you can get them for about 12 cents, and you should aim for a float range of about 0.09. And then you should also use 3 2018 Inferno skins in field tested, with floats under 0.175, and with buy orders, you can get these for 13 cents. If you need a guide about buy orders, then I will leave a link in the description. That's going to direct you to a video that explains everything about buy orders. The main goal of this trade-up is to keep the average float under 0.1155, and that's going to get you the USPS check engine and the M4A1S very camo and factory new. And that's where the money is going to be. So for the outcomes, you can get the three Dust2 skins. All of them have a 21.21% chance of popping up. And the SG Damascus deal and the PP Bison Brass are going to come in minimal wear. And they are going to get you a few cents of profit. Nothing much. But the M4A1S very camo will give you 47 cents of profit and because it comes in factory new because it has a bit more forgiving float range. And for the 2018 Inferno skins, you have a 9.09% chance of getting each one of them. The SSG handbrake and the sawed off brake light will lose you about 14 cents, which is the worst outcome of this trade-up. It loses basically only 10% of the trade-up, so this is a very low risk trade-up. And for the big money, you are aiming to get the M4A4 converter or the USPS check engine which will both give you over a euro of profit, which will double your money basically. The next trade up in the one to five euro price range is gonna be your classic op exoskeleton trade up. It's gonna cost you one euros and 80 cents and it has a profitability of 33.18%, making you 61 cents each time you do this trade up. We're gonna use six minimal wear mil spec broken fang skins for about 18 cents with buy orders and try to keep the floats under 0.09 and for the fillers, we're going to use four breakout skins, again, male spec and factory new for 18 cents using buy orders and aim for a float of under 0.04. The average float should be kept under 0.07 for the whole trade up. And that's going to get you everything in the factory new condition. And for the outcomes, you have an 8.7% chance to get each of the breakout skins which are going to range from a loss of 35 cents with the CZ Auto Tigris to a loss of 88 cents with the PP Bison Osiris or the Nova Koi. These are going to be your worst outcomes. And then for the Broken Fang outcomes, you have a 13.04% chance to get each of them. Three of them are going to be small profits, which are going to be the UMP, the Nova, and the Dual Berettas. The SSG Parallax is going to get you about 86 cents. And the big money is with the Op Exoskeleton, which will yield you 5 euros of profit. I've made a lot of money using this trade up and in fact I've dedicated a video to 45 of these trade ups which I'll leave a link in the description and you can also click the card in the top right corner. The first trade up in the 5 to 10 euro range is going to be another from the Broken Fan Collection but this time restricted to classified. It's going to cost you 6 euros and 30 cents and it has a profitability of 31 and a half percent making you basically 2 euros every time you do this trade up. You have a 50% chance to make profit and you have a 33% chance to break even leaving you only a 1 in 6 chance to actually lose money with this trade-up. So it's it's also a very low risk trade-up. So for the inputs, you're gonna need five restricted field-tested skins from the Broken Fang case. On buyers, you can get them for about 64 cents. And you're gonna also need five minimal wear danger zone skins for about 62 cents on buy orders. For the field-tested skins, aim for a float of about 0.19 and the minimal wear is for about under 0.09. And the important thing here is to keep the average float under 0.14. 
and that's important because that gets you the UMP momentum in factory new which is going to be more expensive than the minimal wear and this is going to minimize the losses. So for the outcomes you have a 50% chance to get a danger zone skin two thirds of which will lose you about 40 to 50 cents and one third the MP5 phosphor will lose you about two euros which is only a third of the trade up so it's still not too bad. And the other 50% is the Broken Fang outcomes. And the M4A4 Cybersecurity will get you 7 euros of profit, which is over double your money. The USP Monster Mashup will get you 5 euros of profit, which is nearly double your money. And the 5-7 Fairy Tale will still get you 2 euros and 75 cents of profit. So anything from the Broken Fang collection is really good with this trade-up. The second trade-up in the 5 to 10 euro range is going to be from the 2018 Nuke and the 2018 Inferno collections. It's going to be mill spec to restricted and we're going to go for all factory new skins. This trade up costs 6 euros and 63 cents and it has a profitability of 13.6% making you 90 cents each time you do this trade up. So for the inputs we're going to need three factory new sawed off brake lights. On buy orders you can get them for 1 euro and 22 cents each. We're using sawed off brake lights because it has the mo most forgiving float range so it's actually going to be super easy to get the 0.02 floats. And for the fillers, we're going to use 7 minimal wear 2018 nuke skins. With buy orders, you can get these for 47 cents. And again, the important thing here is to keep the average float under 0.07 to get everything in factory new. And the outcomes, you're going to have a 70% chance to get a nuke skin, a third of which, which is 23.33%, is going to be a Glock 18 nuclear garden, which will make you 3 euros and 21 cents. And then the other two nuke skins are going to lose you about 2.8 to 3 0.2 euros which again is only about half the cost of a trade-up so it's not the worst and for the 30 percent which you're going to get the inferno skins is going to be really good because you're going to make at least four and a half euros on the mp7 fade you're going to make five and a half euros on the ak safety net and 5.4 euros on the p250v no primo and now moving on to the really big trade-ups the 10 euro plus trade-ups the first one is going to be very similar to the Broken Fang restricted to classified, except it's going to be stat track. It's going to cost you 15 euros and 35 cents, and it has an insane profitability of 44.31%, which will make you 6 euros and 80 cents each time you do this trade up. So for the inputs, again, we're going to use five stat track field tested Broken Fang skins. You can get them for about 1 euros and 42 cents on a buy order. Keep the float under 0.19 to get the best outcomes and for the fillers we're going to use five minimal or danger zone skins of course against stat track and try to get the floats under 0.09 again keep the average float under 0.14 to get the UMP momentum into factory new. But this trade up is a lot better than the non stat track one because this time the UMP and the Deagle will not be break even, but it will be a small profit. This trade up will give you profit five out of six times, which is, I think that's insanely good. It's pretty much a no risk trade up. So for the outcomes, the UMP momentum will give you three euros and 44 cents of profit. The Deagle will give you one euro and 44 cents of profit as it only comes in minimal wear. The MP5 phosphor, which is the worst outcome, will use, lose you 4 euros and 56 cents again not even a third of the cost of the trade-up so it's still not too bad then you'll get an insane profit of 19.45 euros on the M4A4 cybersecurity, you'll make 16 and a half euros on the USPS monster mashup, and you'll make 4.7 euros on the 5.7 fairy tale. So if you're gonna do one trade up from, from this video, this is the one I recommend the most. And then the last trade up, which is also the most expensive of the six trade ups I'm showing you in this video today, is gonna be a classified to covert trade up. And we're gonna go for the minimal wear M4A4 the Emperor. So this trade up is gonna cost exactly 23 euros and it has a profitability of 17%, making you 3 euros and 92 cents each time you do this trade up. So it's not super profitable, but you can make a lot of money if you get just a little bit lucky. So for the inputs, it's gonna be a 1 9 split, and we're gonna use 9 field tested XM10 incinigators. There's really no other option as the revolver skull crusher doesn't come in the right float range and the AUG momentum is way too expensive. So we can only use the XM10 incinigators. And try to get the float under 0.2. And for the 10th filler, I think sniping this would be the best option. Try to get the float under 0.075. Now this trade up is gonna be super difficult to get, but it is possible. I've done it before, and it takes only a, like two to three days to get this trade up together, so it's not too bad. For the outcomes, the best outcome is gonna be the AK-47 Bloodsport, 
which will give you 27 euros of profit, but that only has a 5% chance of happening. And the other Spectrum skin, the USPS Neo Noir, is also profitable, it gives you about 6.6 .6 euros, but again it only has a 5% chance of happening, so most likely you won't see this. The M4A4 Emperor will give you 23 euros of profit on the 45% chance of happening. And then the worst outcome, which is the 57 Angry Mob, aka the 57 Feels Bad Man, will lose you 18 euros. Again, it has a 45% chance of happening, so avoiding that is gonna be key, but if you can get anything else than the 57, then you're gonna be making some good profit. So with this trade up is super duper risky, but the odds are in your favor because there's a 55% chance to make profit. So if you decide to do it, just know that there is the 45% chance to get absolutely wrecked, but it's your call to do it or not. If you try these trade ups, then definitely let me know how they went and how much profit you made using them. So these were today's trade ups. I hope you enjoy them and I hope you can make profit with them. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.